folks, Jim Huss from Keyboard Exchange announcing the new summer sale. I've always kind of considered summer to be June, July, and August, although those may not be the official summer dates. But for this event that we're putting on, it's going to be the June, July, and August summer sale and special event. Make us an offer. We're suggesting that if you see an instrument that you like, don't assume that it can't be affordable for you. Just make us an offer. You might have something of value that we could use or one of the team members here could use, and that could be the down payment on the organ. So let's have some fun. Make us an offer. Let's do some business together and get to know each other. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, boy. <laughs> Hello. Hey, guys. Hi. Hey, 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 We're using the Hammond B3. It's custom made by KeyboardExchange.com. If you all want any organs or an upgrade or them fixed, KeyboardExchange.com does that. Exchange. I'm here with Rodney and uh, Jim Huss. And the thing is, is I've been sitting on a gold mine here in Orlando this whole entire time. He's about, uh, what, 20 minutes away mm -hmm. in uh, Sanford. It's a little outside of Orlando. And this is like one of the best organ stores or organ, I call it an organ extravaganza. <laughs> Jamal, we wanted to take the opportunity to show your viewers some of the internal parts of the organ exactly. when they've been removed from the organ. This is the heart of the organ. It's called the tone generator. It contains 96 tone wheels that spin around. These are the tone wheels. Ah, they're actual wheels. Yeah. Okay. We're not just kidding about them being tone wheels. These tone wheels spin around all that start motor and run motor. Wow. What's the difference between a B3 and a C3? And when the Hammond factory was manufacturing the various parts that go into the various furniture styles, okay. the B3, the C3, the A100, all of those parts as they were being manufactured did not have a model number associated with them until they were installed into a specific piece of furniture. <laughs> Thank you. 
So the Hammond B3, which was manufactured between 1955 and 1974, a 20 year period, is characterized by having four legs. You can see through the organ, it sits on four legs. And the C3 is characterized by having solid back and solid sides, but internally and musically speaking, it's these the are thing. identical musical instruments. <laughs> Now, a lot of times people say, oh, I think C3 sound better. I think B3 I've heard that sound before. better. I've heard that, yeah. I hear it every day. <laughs> but that all comes down to how well the organ was maintained and the acoustics in the room, what Leslie was connected to. There are a thousand variables. <laughs> the C3 and the A100s are all capable of giving us the sound we want and there are some other models as well but these are the three we like to focus on. <laughs> Thank you. 
So what you're saying is the guts is the same. You can get the same sound. It's just a matter of what the furniture looks like. Then here at Keyboard Exchange International, we like to give our uh, customers all uh -oh. the bass they want. Uh-oh. This is not a part of the original organ. <laughs> you brought it out. Yeah. You but, did you it. 99% <laughs> of the musicians say to me, Jim, can you give me more, more bass? bass? Give me more bass. I have to feel it in my chest and my stomach. Okay. So we can make <laughs> your walls shake if you want your walls to shake. Exactly. We add this to the organs that we restore. The B3 is, generally speaking, always going to be the most expensive instrument if it's in great condition because it has the highest market demand. Okay. It's the most popular. Okay. People just want a B3 because it's cool. <laughs> now, if you're in the market for an organ and you would like to acquire one, I will allow uh, one of the great thinkers of our time, my grandson Gabriel, to make a suggestion. Gabriel, what is it you would like to suggest? You should buy my Keyboard Exchange International! <laughs> Hi, I'm Jim Huss, speaking with you from the showroom at Keyboard Exchange International. We'd like to thank all of you who have helped us grow our business for the past 51 years, and it is our intent to find good homes for all the instruments we have gathered uh, from all over the United States. Thank you to the families that have preserved the instruments and then sold them to us knowing that we would find good homes for them. If you, on the other hand, are in need of an instrument, please give us a call. Uh, there's been a lot of effort to gather these instruments together and we would like to make you part of the Keyboard Exchange International family. Let's all work together to keep these fine instruments going long into the future so that we now and future generations can continue to enjoy the wonderful sound of the Hammond Tone Wheel Organ. God bless. Signing off. <laughs>